Before you guys skip through the video, I want to let you know that Dan from EAP Films Official and myself have a new channel called Two Peas in the Podcast, where we cover everything from the Philippines, future travels, behind the scenes, your favourite Filipino artists, and be on the lookout for interviews with fellow YouTubers and some of your favourite idols. So what are you waiting for? Click on the link below, hit that subscribe button, and come along for the ride because it's going to be one hell of a journey. What's up guys? Um, Shay. Today we'll be checking out a video called Coffee in Bed, official music video by Pentatonics. Welcome back to yet another Pentatonics reaction video. It has been roughly a couple of weeks since my last reaction to Pentatonics, although I've just uploaded a couple of Pentatonics reaction videos. They were recorded two weeks ago. But I've been looking forward to seeing this. I still have a lot to catch up on. I'm still holding off from listening to all the music that I've yet to listen to. And although there are many videos to check out previous to this one, based on the title and the thumbnail and the promo that I've been seeing up and down my social media, this is the one next. Not gonna lie, I'm kinda already imagining what coffee in bed would be like in a perfect world where K and Shay existed. And that's kind of the mind frame that I'm stepping into this reaction with. Coffee in bed with Kirsten. So without further ado, let's check this out. It's straight away, the <laughs> first frame. I don't know why I'm getting so giddy right now in this song. Mood. You're a little anxious, but with gratitude. Underneath the blankets and I'm spinning wrong. Staring in the blankness while you're dreaming of a better view. You spend every Saturday morning stuck on a replay of last night. I won't take your words as a warning. And I'll pick you up. Oh, I'm feeling this one. In the south of Texas, back to East LA. Going through our messages, I'm blown away. How can you make me feel so much when you got so little to say? You spend every Saturday morning stuck on a replay of last night. I won't take your words as a warning, and I'll pick you up every time. If you heard it, Wait, I'm getting kind of like more or less super fruit vibes in the song. This is reminding me a lot of their music together. I'm loving that hook. Yeah, this is more a Mitch and Scott track, isn't it? a replay of last night. Won't take your words as a warning. And I'll pick you up every time. Hey. Oh, 
I love that part when Mitch hits that falsetto. That's probably my favourite part of the song. And Kirsten looked like she was waiting me, waiting for me to grab the coffee from her hands and sit on the bed. That was a bloody good song. That's probably probably one of my more favourite current songs that I've heard from Pentatonix, and it's original at that. I'm forgetting that this is an original album. I was getting flashbacks to some of my previous reactions to Superfruit's original music, not only because it was mostly Scott and Mitch singing in the song, but the whole sound is kind of reminiscent of that. I can't remember the name of the song, but I kind of remember the music video. I think it's the one when they're in the club. I think I might have got some hate <laughs> for some of my remarks in that, which kind of doesn't make sense because people kind of just get a bit silly by assuming certain things in the comment section because they think they know me. But this song is a jam. This is something I'm definitely going to be having on repeat. I'm going to add it to my playlist. I'm going to try not to play any of the other songs. Try and save it for when they drop music videos or when I get to a point where I've got no more music videos to react to, I'll react to the audio by itself. But I've waited this long. I'm sure we can wait a little bit longer. And I assume this song was written by Scott and Mitch. I don't even know if they actually write their own music. Is that a very pentaholic thing to say in a video like this? But I'm wondering if this is something from one of their previous albums that they had in the works. You know how they cut songs. I'm wondering if this was one of those songs from Superfruit's album, just because of the sort of vibe and I guess even the topic. I don't know. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this reaction video. Sorry I'm getting a bit behind on some of these, but we are trying, we're getting there, and I will see you guys in the next one.